Yo, what's up, guys? Enemies, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're doing another, or well, the third episode of the JoJo quiz series. And first of all, before we get into this, I want to say huge thanks to everyone watch who watched the previous one. That's got like one of the most views of all my videos. Thank you, guys. All the new guys, all the old guys. Thank you all for watching that. It really means a lot to me. And hopefully, this video can do, you know, at least half as well. Because that, that got like 2.3k views at the time of recording this. And yeah, thank you all so much for clicking on that and leaving a like. It's got like 101 likes, which is one of the most likes I think I've got on any of my videos. But yeah, this one is a little different to um, the previous one. The last one was a YouTube video where I had to get a stand user based on the stand. This one is just a general knowledge from part one to five. So from Phantom Blood, the first series, all the way to um, Golden Wind, which is part five. All the ones that have a full series of anime. So yes. Uh, as I said, I've watched Jojo, I'm a Jojo Connoisseur, I've watched Jojo 1 to 5, I've read Jojo 1 to 4, I haven't got all of 5 manga yet, it's not out yet. But anyway, question 1. Mm, how many people are needed to stop Jonathan scoring during a rugby game? He plays in college, so that's episode 2 of Phantom Blood, I believe it's... It's not 3, it's not 7, he does play rugby, I, I'm pretty sure it's 4, yeah? Oh, okay, cool, cool. While going for the winning run, he's tackled by three members of the other team. He continues to push forwards until the Yeah. It seemed it seemed like it was three, but then I forgot the foot it says how many takes to stop him. If it was how many jumps in, it would have been three. But to stop him, it was four. Yes. Next one. What is the name of the street where Jonathan goes in search of proof his father's been poisoned? So there we go. We've got the, we've got the boy with we'll speed wagon. And then this guy. But was we'll speed wagon. Best guy. And that is Ogre Street. Yes, Ogre Street. Very, very epic. What is the name of the sister of the young boy who joins Jonathan and his friends in a fight with Dio? Um, now this one, I don't think it's any of these. I think it's a different name. So I'm going to go for none of the above, right? Okay, cool. I'm actually... I'm actually Poco's sister is never revealed. Yes, she's just kind of Piccolo's sister. Yeah. I don't recognize any of the names as her name. I mean, I didn't actually know she didn't have a name. But we'll take it, you know. Next one. How does Jonathan set a head? Oh, sorry, Dio's set a head to get aboard the ship Jonathan's on. That would be Wing Chang, his, you know, guy, his minion. Wang Chang? I don't know. I don't want to be racist saying his name, but him. L the, the fortune teller guy. That, that's what he is, right? In the anime, what is the name of the soda pop? Or soda Joe's used to help Floki? Now, I'm pretty sure it is Coca Cola. Right? Oh, no, it's. Coca Cola. Oh, yeah, I thought. I mean. And I don't think they had the rights to use Coca Cola, so okay. I mean, it's simple, it's one letter off. That's right, though. Which of these things is not something Joseph uses while trying to sneak in the secret base hiding the pillow? Well, he's got makeup on, he's got earrings on, he's got tequila. Uh, he's probably wearing heels, so I'm guessing coconut. No, wait, no, coconuts are his boobs. Ah, oh, right, so it's probably heels. Yeah. I thought it was coconuts, but then that's, that is, you know. That area, that's that's that area, his chest, his biceps are made of coconuts. Because he's like, trying to bring in the healer to get in, and yeah. Makes sense, makes sense. In order to seek into the Nazi secret base, I'm the pillow man. He just tries to scan himself with Mexican woman with makeup, jewelry and a dress, where he fails, he had to. Um, forks from two bottles of the healer's knockout, it's cool. Yeah. Oh yeah, he looks like coconuts. Oh, Alright, I thought the coconuts were. Anyway. How does the side character Mark die? I liked Mark. He was he was a decent chap, you know. He, he was a German. He wasn't like a Nazi, but he was just kind of you know trying to live his best life, you know. All right, so he was cut in half by the pillar men. Uh, one moves all the part of his half, upper half of his body. First kills him shortly after awakening. ECDC absorbed him as food. Caesar stops his heart. Yes, because he he got cut in half by um, I think Wamu walked into him without you know meaning to. He kind of just walked, and then Mark just got cut in half, but he wasn't dead, he was still alive. And Caesar put out his misery because they were like, please see it, kill me. He's like, alright then, bet, and he did that to him. Which of these weapons does Shuruheim possess after he turned to a cyborg? Um, right, it, um, he doesn't have a chain whip. He doesn't have that. He has that, and he also has that, so that'll be B and C, yeah? And kind of crack. So that's part one and part two done, and we're now on to... Part 3. Which of these is not a stand Joe Toro has defeated? Well, he defeated that. He didn't defeat. Wait, 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 wait. He hasn't beat Crazy Duck. Wait, this question's kind of good to me, right? 
He beat High Point Green, which is Cat Queen Stand. Um, Abdul beat Silver Chariot, but I guess he kind of beat um, Crazy Diamond. He also definitely beat the World and Anubis. So I'm going to go with Silver Chariot, because that was Abdul. Yeah? It's kind of strange they put one from part four in here. That threw me through a bit of a loop, but. Well, Jojo and Bottom Half um, fought, up... Jojo and fought after part one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. How many Captain planes have Joseph been on? Um, by the time the heroes arrived in Egypt. Um, it was two in the in part two, and then another one when they um, I believe it's four, right? Because two in part two, one when he was a kid, and one where he's going to the volcano. Part three, I believe he crashes. Um, one where the Tower of Grey, which is three, and then with the um, Death Thirteen stand, which is four. So four. Yes. Okay. Man, I'm kind of insane right now, kind of, kind of popping off. Anyway, what was the magazine Jotaro was reading while Pono was getting shaved? Oh. Now, it could be any of these, because he's a marine biologist, where he wants to be. Um, I'm thinking A or D. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, I think it's either one of these two. That's what, that's what I'm guessing, but I'm going to go marine life. Oh my goodness, I forget, your boy. Your boy. I didn't, I didn't actually know that. I just kind of guessed. It's kind of sick. Okay. What is not a way in which Shindero screws with a group of restaurant patrons while using the water stop time? Um. Knocks man over. Um. Calls a man to stab his date. Probably. Oh. I don't know if it has a man eat. I don't remember that part. I don't remember this whole, like, him messing with people part. But also that one, I think it's going to be that one. No, uh, it was pushable. Oh, okay. I mean, he killed other people with a, with a, tra a car anyways. Anyway, that's fine. But, which is not a sound... Oh, no, we're in part four. Which is not a sound effect or phrase um, Kuichi uses to defeat an opponent with a stand. Wish he uses that. I don't think he uses... Um, Wish is what he does with Act 2 against um, the Psycho Girl. Believe in Me is the first time he gets it when he's um, trying to get his mom to believe in him. Boing is the rocks when he's fighting the Psycho Girl. Boom, I don't think he has it. And Sizzle is against Sheer Heart Attack, so I'm going Boom. I, I, what? Oh, oh, I didn't read the question rightly. To use the defeat opponent. Oh, okay, that's my bad. I mean, I had, I had the... Wait. Logic, but like, yeah, he didn't use, yeah, he was, he didn't use going to defeat a person. Okay. Anyway, yeah, anyway, how many pieces is the uh, um that that name? Oh, I, Nijimura. Sorry, I had, to, I had to think of how you say um Akiyasu's last name. Nijimura family photo pulled up before Joe City fixes it. How am I supposed to? How am I supposed to guess this? Like, what? Is there any reference to like anything, or it was just like how many pieces? Now, notice how it's not 14 in there. So, uh, that's giving that logic that there's not 14, it goes 10 to 13, and then 15. I think 13. I guess. So for, if, it, if it's, you know, I don't know, I just thought that would be logical. I don't know if you see the logic there, but I thought that might be it. I'm going to send of growth. Did Yoshikaga hear his fingernail extend per year right before he stopped living with his father? I think it was quite long, but like, that's kind of a donkulous size, so I'm thinking 7? Really, it was 30 centimetres. Per year? Damn, that guy, that guy needs to get his fingernails checked out. Or just die, which is what happened. Okay, uh, but in the part 4 of the anime, how many stands you have been permanently killed? So let's, let's go... I'm to think of all the people who have died in part 4. Well, obviously, um, Kira died. That's Kira there. He died. Um, the guy with red hot chili pepper died. Um, Okiyasu's brother died. Um, also, um, what's her name? The girl with Cinderella, she died. That's four so far. Uh, who, el who else is bad in that? Um, the rat? Does the rat count? I guess the rat counts. That's, that's five. I'm trying to think, because there's so many episodes. There's, like, lots of episodes. So it's five so far, so it's definitely five. Um, 
Who else is who else is dead in part of that? Oh um what's the name? Chingechi? Six. I can't think of anyone else. I'm thinking I think we go with six. I think it's the same logic as the thirteen. Why don't we go with six, right? Eight. Okay. Yeah, Nijimara. Oh the two there's two rats, right. Yoshihongira and Yoshihongira. Who's this guy? Is it? Is that the... I believe that's the music guy, right? Oh, that's that guy. I forgot him. I didn't realise he was... Okay. You know what? Yeah. Okay, um... Which is a skill? What is not a skill? Um, Giorno Giovanni, part 5, by the way. Possesses. Pickpocketing? Well, he does that. Uh, keeping a cigarette left off the mouth. He doesn't do that. Folding in, he does that. Spot a lie via taste. He doesn't do that, so B and B. Because um, B is what um, Jojo could do for some reason. Even though he never does it in the show, it's just said that he can do it. So the Ongo Bongo brothers try, one of them tries to do it. And then Spot a lie via taste, that is Bruno, which he does to Giorno. Which parts of the Ponorath body are not lost during his fight with Diavalo? Or are lost during his fight with Diavalo? Well, his right eye. His right arm, his leg, yeah, all of the above. So he's got um, a robotic leg, what's well, the chair? He's got a robotic arm and his eyes gone. You can see his eyes gone there. Okay, easy peasy. Easy peasy. What I am item that Topia uses to contact me well, So he uses stuff as a telephone. He uses a cigarette, a cat ornament, a frog, an ice cream cone. He doesn't use a crab. He uses, yeah, he uses all these, but not a crab. He's weird because he's like two people in one. And he grabs items that. He makes a ringing sound with his with his mouth without realizing, and he's thinking, "Oh, that's a phone. What's a phone?" Moshi Moshi, and just calls him on on all his stuff. It's pretty weird. All right, which main character does not appear in the final scene of anime adaptation of part five? Which main character? Does that mean everyone who's still alive? Because which one is dead? You see Mister, you see Polnareff, you see Jorno, so A and B, yeah, which one's dead, and you don't see Trish, even though she's still alive in that part, right? 15 out of 20, speedwagon associate member, I'm, I'm a speedwagon boy, that's pretty good. So which ones I get wrong? I got, I got most of them right, I got 15 out of 20, which is decent, I got Coca-Cola wrong, like, what, by one letter. Um, I got... That one wrong. Okay, yeah, that's understandable. Got that one wrong because I didn't read the question correctly. It's like me in actual exams. Got that one correct. Uh, that one wrong because I didn't realize his, his fingernails are super crazy. He's been like the world record for long longest fingernails growth in a year or something. I forgot about those two rats and um, the house inspector guy. I forgot about him. But yeah. Apart from that, kind of kind of cracked. Kind of cracked. So yeah, let me know down below, guys, what you got in this quiz. If you got a better score than me or not. And if so, if 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 you didn't get any wrong, let me know which one you got wrong. If you got more right, I guess you'll be a speedwagon. You'll be a sing one singular speedwagon. If you guys have enjoyed, make sure you like down below. Comment down below your score and let me know, you know, if there's any more thumbnail ideas or if you have any other Jojo quizzes you want me to do. Let me know down below. Say, oh, do this quiz and then like tell me what the quiz is to do with Jojo or ideas for thumbnails so I really enjoy making thumbnail series videos. If you are new and you're a Jojo fan and you also like um, Nintendo um, or Zelda content, please do subscribe, upload videos, like two to three videos a week, maybe more if there's more stuff and yeah, ring that bell. Thank you for watching, keep rolling, peace out.